down the middle of the field. Intercepted. Jordan Lewis with your exclamation point. And very likely the dagger. You got George rushing out there on Jordan Lewis. And Lewis has made play after play in this game. We saw him in the running game. And if this isn't a sports center top 10 play, I don't know what is. Cowboys friends family what's going on it's your boy Fister King I'm back I'm doing this draft highlight prospect situation getting you guys some good information thank you guys for watching all the content I just released the uh, the NFC East draft recap so let me know what you guys think of that um, continue to send people to the channel uh, share the videos around I hope my you guys value my opinion I value your guys's comments I like to show love you guys know that all of you guys who've grown with me since last year's drafting means the world to me. So, um, this one is for Jordan Lewis. 5'10, 188 pounds. Just some things that I've written down, got my notes, all original, just little things for me. Um, watched the Penn State game, watched the Michigan State game from last year. He had a really good battle with a kid named Burbridge. I think Aaron Burbridge. Uh, watched the Ohio State game, played good in that game, and the Florida State game. Now, the Florida State game was a funny one because he played good, he battled all dyke, and then he got beat very late. Nonetheless, you see a kid who has instincts, and in, a lot like Cheeto, can play on the outside, can play on the inside, but just fight. When you're 5'10", at playing the corner position, maybe a little undersized, you have to do one thing well. Well, he doesn't do one thing well, he does a bunch of things well. He's gritty, he will tackle, and he will play aggressive. Come up and bang you. Can play the slot very well. But the thing that I like about this kid is that I think he has 33 inch, 31 inch arms. What's his measurement? 31 inch arms, long arms. So because he's slender and kind of smaller, he doesn't give up much because his jam, very good. His off coverage, very good. Turn and run, very good. And I'm going to highlight some things that he does well in these next couple of videos. So here goes Jordan Lewis. I think that he is a first-round talent, but because of the domestic violence situation, the Cowboys drafted him in the third round. Let me know what you guys think. It's your boy, Fister King. Okay, so here we go with a Mr. Jordan Lewis. Top of your screen. He's not pitcher right now. Boom. Ball in the air. Looks like he has a, a slot type of responsibility on this play now the pressure affects the play however it's so important to me that he's in position has the IQ and the play recognition to understand that the ball may be underthrown adjust on the ball and is ultimately able to make the play now the thing that you heard about this kid at Michigan was they rarely threw at him because he was known as Michigan's best corner, so a lot of quarterbacks didn't try him. Makes a great play right here against Michigan State. Obviously a lesser opponent, but you still want to see your corner, you know, make those types of plays. Now this is one that I really like. Play diagnosis, right there. Able to come down and make a tackle on the bubble screen. Offensive lineman is slow getting out there, but whose fault is that? Is it Lewis's fault? No, it is not. Jordan Lewis, immediately, he can tell by the way that the receiver released. Watch this. He can tell. He didn't move an inch. Instantly makes the play on the ball, come in, wrap up, form tackle. You got to love that. Now, this is what I like about this kid the most. He is a willing tackler. The receiver throws a chicken wing block, comes down, wraps up, doesn't try to run through the guy, doesn't throw a weak shoulder out there, comes down and wraps up. I love that play from Jordan Lewis. The fact that he was able to diagnose the play, shed that weak chicken wing block, and eventually make the tackle. Now, right here, you want to see a cornerback who's willing to get his team off the field, willing to lay it on the line, and right now, this should have easily been a first down. Makes the, makes the receiver adjust right there, comes down, another good form tackle, you know what I mean? Comes mugs, looks at his guys like, yeah, you know what time it is. I don't know that receiver from Wisconsin's name. But the point is, is that play recognition. Saw that they were trying to get the first down underneath, leaves his guy or leaves his responsibility. Receiver bobbles it. That's not our fault. Jordan Lewis comes down, good play. Check out more breakdowns coming soon, you all.